What's up guys? How are you guys doing today? We are starting off another amazing, beautiful day out here in Hawaii. It is actually the earliest I think I've ever woken up in Hawaii yet. It's currently almost 6.30 a.m. And the reason we're up so early today is because we're actually going on this volcano tour. I told you guys a couple days ago that we're gonna be taking a helicopter over the volcanoes. We're actually gonna be hiking up a volcano as well. That's what it said that we should be doing. So this is gonna be fun. This is definitely gonna be an experience. I've never done this before. Lizzie's currently still wrapping up, getting dressed and everything. We're gonna go grab breakfast really quick, and then we will be on our way. The last clip didn't even show you guys the time, so there we go, 6.30 a.m. These lights were like tripping me out the other day. I had no idea where they were coming from. I thought it was just like my vision fucking up, but there it is right there. It's like a light show in here. Hey, now that's a breakfast. All right, and we're on the move. We only had about like 10, 15 minutes to eat breakfast because we're kind of in a rush. We have to be there by a specific time to check in, and of course, we have to be there super early. So our Uber should be pulling up right now. I hope I last throughout today. And what I mean by that is hopefully I don't feel like I have to fall asleep the majority of the day. Because unfortunately, I only got a couple hours of sleep. I'd say like three hours of sleep tops. Because I actually woke up to my Snapchat and my Twitter being hacked. And the person that was hacking me was actually trying to hack my YouTube and all my other social media platforms as well. Luckily, they did not succeed. So that definitely uh, put a bump in my road. And I woke up to like 40 texts this morning from people telling me I was hacked. But we're on the Uber now. Let's go. And the person that hacked me was actually like spamming these like get free iPhone 7 links on my on my Snapchat and my Twitter. So if you guys happen to have seen that, I hope you didn't click it. I don't know if they can get into your account by you swiping up on that or clicking the link. But for anybody who did click it, I apologize. It wasn't from me myself. But that wasn't really the greatest way to start off the day. Luckily, I did get my accounts back though, so that's good. <laughs> this is how Lizzie's doing her makeup right now because she didn't do it yet today. You're all Russian. Russian. Soviet production. Makeup does you. <laughs> All right, we just got over here. I'm hoping they have our names written down because we never actually got like our ticket confirmation, but the guy called us on the phone and yeah. said we're good to go for today. So I'm just, I'm hoping everything turns out okay. So there's a couple different hangars over here. It wasn't the first one we went into. Hopefully it's one of these because they said they don't do the uh, volcano tours in the big island. So this might be the one. Oh my God. Okay, so it wasn't them either. Yo, I swear if I booked tickets with this company and paid that much money and there's no refunds either by no, the way guys which is annoying yeah so if we can't figure out exactly where this is and or they didn't book our tickets i'm gonna be pissed <laughs> not this one either yo you gotta be kidding me there's only like one or two places left i think it's one actually left man <laughs> if it's not this one i i don't know a few moments later not this one either lizzie actually just ended up calling the place we found out it's this place called hawaiian like up here so it's the only spot we haven't tried yet let's go check it out the only reason we're having such difficulty right now is because this ticketing company never sent us our confirmation for some reason so i guess the only way to find out was calling them this company this ticketing company is completely trashed so they gave us the location to go here apparently we weren't supposed to go here we have to go to the actual airport and then we take a plane over to an island where then we take a helicopter to the volcano area oh my this is so confusing we're gonna be late we're most likely not gonna make it like i, I have no idea because our check-in time was about 10 minutes ago and how long is it gonna take us to get there well the uber's eight minutes away so and arrival time at seven 51 a.m. From now on, I'm not going through these little travel agency things. I'll just book the flight myself because, dude, like, it, like it's just running into problems for us. Literally running through the airport right now because we're gonna be late. All right, and we made it. See, we were confused because we didn't know that we had to actually get on a flight. We thought we were just going to this like hangar and then we were gonna end up getting on a helicopter from there and going. We didn't know that all this was happening because it wasn't explained to us originally. It's all good though. We made it. <laughs> this is the most leg room I've ever had on a flight before. That's crazy. I mean, that's nice. I noticed this when I first got on the plane, but look how much steam is coming out of this plane. That's insane. Yo, you wanna know what's funny? That sign, they take so serious. I did it for two seconds, and they're like, whoa, 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 next time you do that, it's gonna be hell. And I was like, uh, okay. <laughs> like, I did it for two seconds. I was doing it as a joke. Oh, 
Yo, this travel company we're with is so bad. Like, they didn't even tell us where to go. We're sitting over there waiting for the longest time. Like, even she agrees. <laughs> That's funny. This is gonna be a pain in the ass. I'm not allowed to have my tripod with me, so I'm gonna have to hold this camera very awkwardly. I'm, I'm gonna go give this to them real quick. There's the airplane. It's a helicopter. That's a tricycle. That was amazing. Yeah. Yo, that was crazy. Like I've never seen lava in person before. And I mean, even though we didn't get super, super close to it, I still got to see it and it was I'm beautiful. I'm speechless. Yeah, it was like, crazy. That was amazing. Was that really was like sick. one of the best experiences I've ever had. Yeah, right? That's how I feel right now, passing out. You guys wanna know what's funny? We literally just got our itinerary from this company, like just now. And we've already done the volcano trip and everything. We're actually waiting currently on our driver because I told you guys we're gonna do that little hike, but we're gonna try and figure out what we can do for food right now as well. I'm so it's lunchtime. mad because the hungry. first thing that this says is to go to the Hawaiian Airlines. Yeah. We would have known to come right here. Yep. <laughs> but they're assholes and they didn't tell us that, so. Holy bumpy. Uh, so bumpy. <laughs> we just sat down to grab some lunch really quick. I'm probably just gonna end up grabbing a cheeseburger. I think Lizzie's doing the same. Yo, me and Lizzie literally got the same exact way of like our burger being made and everything. We always do that. We always get the same thing. I don't know why. We're so similar when it comes to food. Like, I know. We're just very picky eaters. I don't I, know. I, I, hey, there we go. Got our burgers. Much better. I don't feel like completely passing out now because I was so hungry. That's good. Okay. Back at a bus, the cool kids. Until we hit a bump and hit the fucking oh, hit our I, head I on the top. I remember that. <laughs> I used to actually like I've sat in the back of the bus before, but I actually preferred to sit up in the front because I would get off first. Like or it would be a lot easier to get off. I don't know. So we just got over here to like this volcano national park, but it's getting a little chilly outside and they even said it's supposed to get even chillier. Which I mean Lizzie definitely gets cold very easily, so she wants to try and get a hoodie right now. There you go, Lizzie, you can get a park ranger outfit. <laughs> Lizzie cannot find a small anywhere. <laughs> what was the smallest to have? A large. A large? It's gonna be huge. <laughs> oh my god, that's huge. I don't know what to do. Either suck it up or get a large. Oh, I'm sucking it up. So it looks like Lizzie ended up getting the oversized hoodie, but she also got something else. She got something for grandma. The turtles. Grandma loves turtles. <laughs> I'm actually gonna be trying to go back to Jersey pretty soon. I told you guys this uh, before, but I haven't been there in a while. So hopefully within the next couple weeks, I'll plan out a trip to go back there. What's that? A little keychain with your name on it? Yeah. Elizabeth. <laughs> Lizzie, what the hell did I tell you about walking out with no pants on? I have pants on. Only I can do that. <laughs> got some steam vents over here. Oh, it's so hot feeling. You feel it? No? It's too much? Yeah, it smells really weird. <laughs> yeah. Just stood in front of it, I feel like I'm soaked now. I know, me too. <laughs> Dang, that's a massive hole. Holy crap. I'd build a pool in that thing. <laughs> it's a giant ass pool. Crazy how many areas there's steam coming out of. It's just like everywhere. We got in the bus just in time, it's downpouring now. It's funny watching these people run. Trying to get out of the rain. And then they just stop. Like, she's still going. <laughs> She's like, fuck it. I'm actually gonna walk on some areas that was once lava that dried up into rock. This is gonna be pretty cool. Apparently it's a lot lighter than we would expect as well. Is it light? Oh my, it feels like nothing. <laughs> it feels like almost absolutely nothing. I'll pick up like a really big piece. It feels super light, doesn't it? I can hold it with a finger. <laughs> what? Look how interesting that looks. That's so cool. That's so cool. Wow. You can see the iron's kind of coming out of it. It's all red. Ready? Be careful. This is going to end up busting our ass, I know it. No, I'm not. That is sick. Oh my god. You can literally see how it started to like flow and then it like stopped. Like you know how icicles like it 
dripping and yeah. then it just stays into a cycle. Come down here. You gotta like crawl through here. Look, you can see oh, yeah. how it just like stopped. That's so cool. It's so weird because it looks like it's just like melted metal. This almost kind of looks like mud too. Or wood. It resembles wood a little bit. It's weird how light it is compared to like normal rock. I know. Honestly, I wish there was just like a little bit of lava so we can like right. mess around with it and just like experiment with it. Like drop stuff in it to see how quick it burns. That'd be fun. What I really would want to do would like get one of those like scoopers and scoop it out and then pour it and see how fast it turns into the metal or whatever. The metal? <laughs> is, what's it turn into? Just like rock. It's just rock pretty much. No, there's like, obviously there's like iron and stuff in it. That's why eventually over time it turns yeah. into a color like this. You can tell there hasn't been lava in this area for a while now because there's actually some uh, plants starting to grow over here as well. When you step on this, it just seems so hollow. Like listen to the sound of that. Straight up just seems hollow. Honestly, I can't really tell what's growing on this. Is this like mold or is this like, I think it might be. All right, mighties. Today, we're exploring a live volcano. Let's check it out. Oh shit, she's attacking. Gotta get out of here or I don't make it alive. Oh fuck. Now we're not actually allowed to take anything off the island, unfortunately. As much as me and Lizzie would love to take like one of these cool looking rocks home, yeah, we're not allowed. Cool to have as like a little souvenir, but you can't. Yeah, they'll probably end up stopping us or something. Apparently yeah. it's illegal. I know to you guys it might not look like this hole is deep, but oh, it is so is deep. So you gotta be careful. End up like slipping on a rock. Oh, this rock doesn't even break either. It's like no matter how hard you throw it or what you throw it at, it's barely breaking. Oh, oh, oh. Nothing happened. Well, he he really? just whistled and you can hear that. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. That so cool. Ew! <laughs> I heard it like all the way down there. Yeah. Yeah. Ew! <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> I'm trying to get like the best one. Ew! <laughs> Extraining my vocal cords right now trying to get that. <laughs> I don't know if you guys could hear it, but it's crazy. Like I've never heard an echo like that in real life yeah. before. Like I've heard echoes in like parking garages and stuff, but this is completely different. Like it just sounds almost as loud as you were. I don't know how to describe it. All right, we made it over to the airport. We board our flight in about 30 minutes. We're gonna go through uh, TSA right now. We actually have two flights to catch because they don't have a direct flight back to Maui, which is the place we are going to. They had a direct flight to here, but unfortunately they don't have a direct flight back. So we got like over no biggie though the airports are nothing here compared to what we deal with back in hollywood or jersey man like we get through the tsa so quick we could literally come here 20 minutes prior instead of an hour and a half and be completely on time i didn't realize that when we first got here because we've never actually flown out of here yet we we flew into here but not out that's the first time so so we were scrambling around this morning rushing but there wasn't really any need to because i know 100 percent for a fact if we would have gotten to like lax airport the same time that we ended up at this airport this morning we would have not made our flight at all so much missed oh i just got soaked raindrop landed on my face all right first flight down one more to go i'm excited to get back and probably just end up passing out <laughs> i need food yeah me too i feel like 50 percent of the words that come out of my mouth on a daily basis are food or sleep yeah it's good. <laughs> pretty much we found a place for food we were actually just gonna end up getting food when we landed in maui but we found a starbucks right here shout out to the starbucks they just hooked us up thank you they're so kind man like we we specifically like they were fans and um we specifically said um, I that said we know like 500 yeah because they them. offered they kept asking you know and i was like no 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 we'll pay for it we'll pay for it and then they just hooked it up so that's kind of them i always feel bad when that happens liz even just said the same thing like i appreciate it so much I but know, me too when, when like i just feel like even when somebody offers me something i still should pay for it right they just want to accept the payment though <laughs> but that was very kind of them are we on another plane or did i just record this and put it later on in the video we're on yeah. Whew. About time. Finally off of all the flights for today. As you guys can see, Lizzie is pretty much dead right now. I think that's pretty much gonna wrap up today's video. There's not really anything else exciting going on today. I mean, we're gonna take an Uber home and probably end up passing out. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss any new videos. I give notification shout outs every single day to people that have my notifications turned on. Just leave a comment down below. Here are today's notification shout outs for the day. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. If you guys are interested in any of our 210 merchandise, make sure to click the link down below at the very top description. Check it out over there. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on my post notifications. And if you haven't already, make sure to check out yesterday's video as well.